Hi guys, uh, my name is Andy and uh, I'm sitting here, it's a Saturday night and uh, I'm chilling out, I've had a few dark and stormy cocktails as you do, you know, and um, I put myself a Ron Sacapa 23 Solera and you know, I haven't tried this rum for a good few months and one thing I will say about it is, it is one of them rums you keep going back to. You know, um, some people have said it's the best rum in the world. Uh, is it the best rum in the world? No. I will not ever say that about any rum because there is always one around the corner waiting to wow you. You know, straight away, Ron Sacapa 23, absolutely beautiful. I've uh, got probably four or five more shots the size in this glass in my bowl and I have a full bottle, litre bottle to replace it in my cupboard already so that speaks volumes you know it is an excellent rum no question one of the best in the world it is great but if you go to the XO you know which is Ron Sacapa, uh, pretty much is Ron Sacapa 23 aged for extra two years in cognac casks. That totally takes it to another level, a level, level of smoothness for sure. And uh, you smell the cognac in it rather than the uh, Pedro Jimenez uh, sherry casks, which you do smell in this. Um, so, you know, there we go. Straight away, I can, I can pick you another rum which just take you to this, you know, up to another level. So I would say the EXO is fantastic but then it does go to a different price you almost double the price of uh, 23 so um, you know this rum here it just keeps you going back it's beautiful you smell it it oozes chocolate it just really got that little chocolatey notes in the background there's a a coffee sort of coffee bean sort of smell to it and flavour it's fantastic it's so sweet it's just unbelievable it's smooth there's no burn whatsoever it's just amazing rum I love it it's great now um, I thought I'd just share a few little words with you just to let you know what's coming up um, I have a couple of rums coming up in the pipeline it's for reviews on Andros 200 on YouTube Thank you for your support, but keep watching because I have a review coming real soon. Two reviews, actually. One of them is a really, well, two of them are really sought after rums, actually. They are, like, way up there. Uh, you have, I am bringing you a review of Pirate Cask. Now, Pirate Cask is, uh, is a rum which is, like, way people aspire to uh, taste it. When they do... A lot of people are left on the fence, not a bit, you know, bamboozled by it because it's by the pirate range of rums have a very sort of orange zesty, uh, orange flavour to the rums, and people say, you know, is this from, um, you know, additives or you know some kind of, uh, you know, flavourings, or is this from actual aging because it's made in the, at the diamond distillery in Guyana and they have a high ester steel in in that distillery and um, it produces rums with really intense flavor and you know people are left on the fence wondering whether it comes from the aging from the from that steel or whether it is from flavorings so um, you know I'm bringing that review to you really soon another review I'm bringing to you is um, Brugal's top of their portfolio rum, which is Siglo de Oro. Um, absolutely amazing rum. Uh, now this rum is, uh, like I said, from Brugal, and you can't really pick it up in the UK, to be, to be honest with you. It's one of them rums which is really hard to get hold of. They produce 2,000 bottles per year, um, along with uh, um, Unico which is from Brugal. And they only produce 2,000 bottles per year of that rum, and they are mainly snapped up straight away within the Dominican Republic. 
So I think I found a place in the UK you won't find the ball. You may do, you know, prove me wrong. If you can, great. Post it on my on my blog and um, let people know where they can get it from. But I've just had a good search and I could only find a bottle in Germany. Four bottles, actually, in Germany. And they wanted about 140 euros per bottle. And uh, then if you were to import it over to the UK, you're going to be paying a silly price for packages, posting and packaging. And it's going to take it up to a real, real, you know, higher price. So um, those reviews are coming real soon. So uh, keep an eye on, like I said, Andros 200. Uh, thank you for your support. And uh, like I said, I'm sitting here chilling with a Ron Sacapa 23 Solera. And until next time, enjoy. Yes.